Oh, right, everybody. We have a new burst mode here. We actually have two, but we're going to be going over the Vegito Dokkan event burst modes. This is, you know, the one with Vegito. <laughs> That's what we're going to be doing first. We're going to be going over a top, uh, or well, not a top. I just did chain battle. Sorry. This is a 6,000 point run to get 19 of your 20 missions done. And then you just have to do the other category. You don't have to put on any other multipliers. You just turn on the other one, do a run. And, uh, you know, you win. So, you know, do whichever one of these is easier for you first. If, to me, this is meant to be like you come in here with the Vegito. Like, you go into Gogeta's with Vegito, and you go into Vegito's with Gogeta. You get them built up. You make them do, like, bajillion attack stats, and you just have fun using them, right? To me, that's what these are meant to be. Um, so, let's go ahead and hop in here. I'll show you guys what I did. I actually already did the Gogeta one. Or, I'm sorry, I, I did the Vegito one. Which is this one right here, that's why everything is already set. So I did fusion only. Um, you can do heavenly events, and you get quite a huge boost for that, uh, for doing heavenly events. So, you know, if you go with that one, then you can kind of play around with your sliders a bit more. Um, you get a little bit more freedom, but heavenly events is going to be a little bit more restrictive in terms of the characters that you can bring. Um, I did fusion, and then AGL and STR, because that gives me access to um, both blue Gogetas, the AGL EZA and the STR LR EZA, who just came out. Uh, so that's what I did there. 350 or less team cost, not too bad because there are some free-to-play options. Um, this is a little stringent. The original team that I was building, whenever I calculated it out, I was actually at 351 team costs, and I was like, dude, please. Um, you know, it does include the friend character, though, so keep that in mind. It may limit your ability to bring another one. But this point swing, I mean, it's kind of big. 110, like right here, would knock me out. But, you know, it, it's it's something that you can play around with. I did 350 and had no issues. Um, I turned on all of these except for the attack. Uh, if I can avoid turning on this attack multiplier, I do it. Um, if you want to go for, like, a super crazy challenge run and try to get, like, you know, like, max points possible, that's on you. Go for it. Um, but personally, I just like to, you know, get this over with. <laughs> so that's what I turned on there. We have damage received reduced by 15% on, of course. I, again, I don't turn on any of the attack buffs. You know, for me, uh, you know, people probably, like, stray back and forth between what they like to do. For me, I'd rather just have a safe run where I don't have to worry about some random free-to-play character that I'm bringing getting super attacked or something like that and just ending my 30-minute run. Because <laughs> if you guys have not played burst mode before, sometimes these runs can go on for a long time. Uh, <laughs> So, like, this video may end up being, like, 15, 20 minutes long, but my actual run might be, like, 30 minutes. So, we'll, we'll see. Again, I boosted the defense all the way up. Uh, this doesn't affect my score a ton. I could lower this. It'd be, it'd be fine. But I maxed out the HP um, right here. Again, I could lower some of this and just get through it a little bit faster. All you need is 6,000 points, right? Um, all allies key minus three. We're on a fusion team. Most of them are going to have fused fighter and, like, over in a flash prepared for battle. So... He should, in generally, generally not be an issue. Um, and then support items are not allowed. That gets you a huge boost. And then support memories are not as loud. Gets you a small boost. So um, let's go ahead and hop in here to my team building. Uh, this is the team that I have built. But let's go ahead. We have to change the leader. Um, we can use... I think we can use... No, we can't use the LR. But we can use you. There we go. So let's bring the friend. So this, this is my lineup that I'm rocking with right here. Um, these guys just got their EZA on Global right before this uh, anniversary during the Super Boost celebration. Uh, so you can go farm them up. They're a sub EZA, I believe, of the Tech Gotenks EZA, I think. Um, so you can go farm them up. They're pretty decent. These are just general banner units, but they are supports, and they're pretty decent after their EZA. Uh, this guy's free to play. Uh, you buy him with chocolate in the Baba Shop. You get the chocolate from a Majin Buu Saga story event. And then this is a Heroes unit. I mean, I just brought him because he fit the team cost, so... This is what we're rocking with. Again, this guy's meant to be the star of the show, so it's just a playground for him, essentially. Uh, we're going to hop in here. I'll play a little bit of the event, maybe show you a few attack stats. But uh, for the most part, I'm going to cut out most of this run right here. Uh, just because it, it's going to go on for a while. So uh, try to get the key paths whenever you go into burst mode, just because, you know, you most likely selected a modifier that's going to lower your key. So you should try to get some of that back here. Um, by picking up as many of these as you can. Sometimes your characters will be greedy and it'll all go to one guy, but uh, hopefully it gets spread around evenly so that whenever you hop in here, everybody just has a little bit of extra starting key. Um, you can see here quite a few of my characters do. Um, I do have intros and active skills turned off, but I don't think we have anybody with an intro on the team. Uh, we'll keep my Gogeta around, float the friend. 
and we'll just get going here. So I'll come back whenever something interesting is happening or like, you know, we're a little bit further into the event. Uh, but for now, you know, this is burst mode. Just hop in here, give it a shot, play around with the multipliers, see if you can find a combo that you like. Again, you only need 6,000 points. So just, you know, work with what you have. Try to find a combo that you like, like I said, and um, hop in here and uh, see how it goes. So uh, I'll come back again whenever, you know, something interesting is happening or we're towards the end of the event. So uh, see you guys then. All right, so we're here on turn six, and I think we're about to finish out the first phase of the Dokkan event here. We got Gogeta Blue out, <laughs> doing a 10 million attack stat. That's pretty good, right? <laughs> we're, uh, we're almost out of here. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, not quite. There we go. All right, we're out of the first fight. <laughs> I think two more, two more phases here, or three more. I'm sorry, this one and then two more. So, uh, we still got a long ways to go. Again, I'm just going to hang out here and keep doing this event. So, uh, uh, you know, I'll, I'll hop back in whenever we got something else interesting going on. Uh, y y we, we got the long haul here. So, see you guys in half an hour. <laughs> oh, we're getting the Dokkan of attack, guys. I had to press unpause on OBS. Oh, no. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> we're getting the Dokkan attack. Look, we're, we're on turn 10. We're getting the Dokkan attack. Uh, I, I, I don't know if this will kill. I think it might. We're, we're going to get the guaranteed crit. I mean, you know, we're just, we're going through here. I, I said I would come back whenever something interesting was happened, or it was happening. You know, nothing interesting is really happening there, but that, I mean, that was kind of cool. Oh, I mean, was that interesting? I don't know. We came back for it. All right, he's going blue. Uh, so we're down to two more phases. We got this one and then the next one. So, you know, with uh, with every moment, we, uh, we draw closer to the end of this stage. <laughs> nice. Anyway, again, I'm just going to keep going through this. Uh, hopefully you guys aren't having much trouble with this. I, I think the biggest issue a lot of players may have is just the roster. Um, you know, if you're brand new, you probably don't have a lot of these characters. So, I don't know what to tell you. Just, uh, do your best. There's not a whole lot of free-to-play options, honestly, for these categories for Heavenly Events and Fusions. There's a few, uh, but not very many. I would just say, you know, use your resources. Use the Dokkan Wiki. Use the, uh, Dokkan T6 Wiki. You know, there's the fandom wiki, there's the T6 wiki, and the info site. I use those all the time. Great sources of information. Hop on Reddit. You know, look at other YouTube videos, see what other people are doing. Just uh, surround yourself with knowledge. That's uh, that's the only advice I have for you. Again, we will hop back whenever something uh, interesting is going on. Okay, so I had to bring you guys uh, back for this part right here. So, uh, Gogeta actually did a triple super attack, which is pretty rare. So, uh, decided to go ahead and pull this back up. We got the hidden potential too, but we uh, we just got the normal from it instead of the super. So, yeah, you can see here. Uh, I don't think we were at 24 key. I, I don't think. I've watched this turn twice and I don't remember. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we, we got the triple super here. So, we did a ton of damage. So I figured, hey, this was pretty interesting. I would bring you guys back for this part. So, I mean, you got to see that. That's pretty cool. I'm sure for you guys, this video is like just really jarring, which I apologize. I'm just doing like these hard cuts and all this because I'm just using the pause recording button on OBS. Uh, so you're, you're just hopping from one scene to the next. But I figure a lot of you are just skipping through this anyway. You're just mashing that arrow key. <laughs> So, you know, if you are, that's cool. But, uh, yeah, we're just going to continue to go through. We're on turn 15. We're uh, almost done with phase 3 of 4. So, got one more phase coming up after this one. We'll come back whenever we're at the end of this phase. So, uh, getting close, getting closer. Getting closer with every passing turn. Uh, unexpectedly, we finished this phase. So, hey, we're finally doing it. We're moving on into the final phase. I didn't think that we were going to KO on that. I thought we were going to get one more turn out of that, uh, out of that phase. So... Uh, it's gonna get a little bit tricky here because, uh, we got, you know, a couple, we have quite a few AGL units on the team. We have taken some damage somehow. Not sure when that happened, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. We, we will make do as always. Let's go ahead and heal up a little bit, uh, with Gogeta. We want to make sure this Goten can super attack, but I'm not sure we're going to be able to get it. Let's do this and hopefully it drops the purple. Okay, that'll work. Nice. Uh, we, I think he gets defense on super attack. I haven't used that Goten like since he came out. <laughs> okay, just dodge that. Perfect. We're fine as long as Gogetas are dodging the super attacks, then uh, we're we're gonna be absolutely okay here. You know, that's that's our big worry is if uh, one of the AGL units gets supered, that's what I'm really concerned about. So, 
you know, as long as he wants to keep targeting uh, Gogeta and Gogeta wants to dodge, we are all good here. So, you know, this is my Gogeta with a full dodge build there. So uh, we're getting close, getting close to the end of the event. Again, I will cut and come back whenever uh, something interesting is going on. We got a, we got a lot of health to take off of this guy. So see you guys in, well, for, for you, it's going to be instant, but for me, it's going to be a few minutes. So uh, see, see you guys then. Uh-oh, the friend Gogeta got supered. I don't know how much damage this is going to do. Oh, double digits. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> I was really worried. I, I was I was actually terrified. I was like, oh, no. <laughs> we're fine. All right, we're fine. Listen, false alarm. We're all good. <laughs> we're, we're good. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we're fine. Everything is good. <laughs> we are okay. How are we doing on defense here? Let's, gra let's grab some AGL orbs. <laughs> Woo, that was a little spooky. Uh, I won't lie to you. That was, uh, that was a little spookums. That, that one... Uh, I was sweating a little bit there. <laughs> oh, I really need... Oh... I really need to save those for next turn. Uh, does this guy get, like, key on super attack or anything? No, he doesn't, because of course not. Why would they make the hero's units good? Uh... Oh, that would be so much healing next turn, but I, I need a super attack, so uh, we gotta do that. Okay. Listen, we're gonna make it through this. Uh, I think after this turn, I think we can use... It'll depend on how much this guy does. A double super would make me feel at ease a little bit. Uh, if we can just get to the 50% threshold, we can, uh... Okay, I think we're there. I think that's 50%. So I'll, I'll just leave the recording going from here. Um, we can get big daddy mode Gogeta out here on the next turn. I We should be under 50% HP now. So uh, we can use this active skill in slot 3. That'll give us the full buff. Uh, that'll give us the 70% chance to dodge. The extra additional... Um, and the extra, what, seven key and the crits for the turn, so we can start laying into this guy, uh, on the next turn. Yes, perfect, okay. Uh, I am gonna go ahead and play this. Alright, uh, pretty good damage for this burst mode, considering, like, how crazily buff the, uh, the enemy is. Alright, let's go ahead and grab these. That should be fine. Man, I really wanted more of those AGL orbs to drop, uh, but we'll grab that. And then we'll grab these. Um, so Gogeta has a 70% chance to dodge. Yep, you can see that activating now. He's gonna do his super attack at 18 key. It's gonna be a crit. All, all the attacks on this turn are guaranteed crits. This is a 12 million attack stat, guaranteed crit. He has a guaranteed additional coming in. Then he's going to get his two normals as well that could each be super attacks. You know, we want we want a lot of super attacks here, buddy. So this is the guaranteed additional he gets for attacking in slot three. Uh, we got two normals coming in after this that could be supers. So there's one normal. We got one more. It rolled as a normal. And then we still have the hidden potential chance. It rolled as a normal as well. Okay. That is unfortunate, but we still did some decent damage on this turn. Uh, we know that if Gogeta Blue, either one gets super attack, they'll take double digits here. Uh, I would like to see a super that would make me feel a little bit at ease here. Uh, not crazily at ease, but just, just a little bit. We're getting close. Uh, we're really close, but so was our HP, you know. Uh, things are not looking great, but oh, we didn't get supered. Uh, that probably means he's opening next turn with a super, and we are at such low HP, man. Oh my goodness. Uh, okay. We're going to get some healing. My Gogeta has full dodge. We're going to grab this. Okay. This is going to give us some healing, and it should get us the Dokkan attack? Yes. Okay. 
All we need is this guy to dodge the super attack. Oh, we're not getting... Dude, this Goten. This Goten is going to be the end of me. Are we at... oh, I think if we can just survive these two attacks, I think we're good. Okay, there's one. Two. Okay, let's get the Dokkan attack. Uh, again, Gogeta Blue does guaranteed crits, um, the TUR, so... All we need to do is get the Dokkan attack. Two more nodes. Okay. I think we can KO him before we get to Goten. <laughs> I think. Uh, <laughs> oh, man. Tur imagine imagine losing right here on turn 23 with this little HP left. <laughs> that would be really unfortunate. So, uh, let me know what you guys thought about this burst mode. I had a little bit more trouble this time around than... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, <sighs> no. Uh, uh, yes, we can survive. We can survive, because this Goten will take double digits. And we know that the Goten at the end will also take, uh, well, he'll take, like, 40k, right? That's how much he, that's how much he took last time, was, like, 46 to 50k. Oh, you need additional super, oh, thank goodness. Oh, okay, we live one more turn. <laughs> okay, we're good. Uh, we don't have the active skill. But, uh, I, I'm just gonna trust in our raw defense here. Uh, we should be good. We're gonna get a Oh, we got the Dokkan attack, so yeah, we're, we're, we're totally good here. Alright, whew! That was a little bit spookier than it needed to be, but let me know what you guys thought about this burst mode. Um, for the other mission, you know, I could just hop in real quick and just get a Heavenly Invents run done. So I, I might do that just to, you know, get the last mission on camera, but... Um, yeah, I mean, this is the exact same team I used to beat it the first time, so we know that this clears all of the missions. Whew! A little bit spooky there. Uh, but we got it done. We got it done. <laughs> oh, man, that one. A uh, little bit tough on these burst modes. I I was having some trouble with the Patara one earlier. I was just doing some team builds, like like a lunch break at work. I was testing it out. All right, there we go. Whew. Uh, 30 minutes, 30-minute 30 run for you guys cut down to 17. So let's get, uh, let's get one more run in here uh, with the other category. I got to mute the game real quick so let's just do this and then let's actually let's just hit reset and now heavenly events okay so then all you have to do is come in here with the heavenly events team that's not hard you just you know grab some units and you'll be fine uh we'll just grab i don't know uh who, who do we want to get let's bring like uh where's this guy let's bring them and i don't know piccolo sure yeah i mean it doesn't really matter who we bring here uh the only thing that matters is that we have heavenly events on the team so you know get get your first run done uh, woo, listen, no playing music here. But yeah, you get your first run done with all the modifiers on. So pick whichever category is stronger. Do that to get your 6,000 point run. And then hop in here with the other category and just, you know, don't worry about your 6,000 point run. Just, you know, do the free run here. And, uh, yeah, that's all you gotta do to, uh, beat Vegeta, or, well, beat Vegito Blue, right? Beat his burst mode is just, uh, get all the luck in the world. No, it didn't really take that much luck. We just, uh... Uh, I guess we got a little bit lucky with that one Goten turn where he got super attacked. Or I guess we got unlucky because we couldn't get key. You know, just make sure that if you're bringing a character that's weaker defensively that they're just staying out of harm's way. I know easier said than done, but, you know, then you can just hop in here with the other category and get all of your missions done. So, uh, let me know what you guys thought about this burst mode. Uh, I'm sure a lot of you had trouble with it. I know a lot of my viewers are new players at this point. Or at least the active ones that are commenting a lot are. So, you know, if that's you, again, I'm sorry, a lot of this stuff just comes out from, or a lot of this, these events just require you to have a more filled out box than usual. So, you know, it, it's not that necessarily you're bad or anything. Uh, maybe you're bad, I don't know. <laughs> but it may not necessarily be that, it may just be that your box is just not quite there to where you can really take on these events right now. So, because, I mean, because, I mean, how many Heavenly Events category characters even are there on the current banners? Like... Not many, right? If any at all? I can't think of any, so... Uh, it, it's, it's definitely rough, right? And then there are some fusion characters, but not very many, so... Again, I get it. It's it's pretty rough uh, starting out, but, you know, for you veteran experienced players out there, you know, let me know if you guys were having any trouble with this. Um, yeah. Uh, anyway, this is the guide. We're gonna go ahead and cut here, and I'll come back whenever I've got, you know, this thing completed. I mean, we're almost done here. We're already on Piccolo probably one-shots here. Okay, he's gonna do a second super, and he's gonna... Well, why do I even need to cut? I, we won't cut. We, we will do this, so... Um... Yeah, again, a, a lot of this stuff in the game now just comes from having a, uh... 
you know, a, a large box. I mean, that's just the way things work, right? Like, Battlefield alone requires you to have basically 100 units to go complete. Oh, well, not 100. What do you need? You need, like, 7 times... Uh, multiplied by... Uh, 10. You need like 70 units minimum to go play Battlefield. I mean, that, that's not easy, right? Like, that's easier said than done, so... A lot of the game modes in the in, in Dokkan now just require you to have more units, so... Uh, this is definitely one of those modes where they're just gonna pick two random categories and expect you to have, like, a filled-out category for it. And if you're, I don't know, within six months of playing, you may not even be able to field a team, so... It, it can be kind of difficult. Um, not much I can help you with in the way of team building. Just make sure you've got a solid leader and you're just trying your best with what you've got. So, uh, let me know how this went for you guys. Uh, we're gonna wrap up here soon. If Boo crits, he might just take this home for us. That would be appreciative. Or appreciated. I would be appreciative. I would appreciate him. I don't know. Yeah, there we go. Let's see. Uh, you could have gotten an additional there, buddy. That would have been nice. All right, Gohan, bring us home. <laughs> this is a lot faster, right, than uh, the 30-minute run. <laughs> that was the other run. <laughs> a, little, a little bit easier, right? Oh, come on, get the additional. Perfect. Uh, Gohan takes us home. Four turns is a lot better than 20. So that's the last mission I needed for this Vegito Dokkan event burst mode. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Again, I'll show you that I have this done. Uh, and then I'm going to hop in and get the Gogeta guy done right after this. So stay tuned. Be on the lookout for that. I'm going to try to get those out tonight as well as getting my showcases for tomorrow recorded. I think we're going to hop into a Broly uh, next. So be on the lookout for Broly tomorrow or today, depending on whenever you're watching this. So there we go. Again, I have to mute. I have to mute that. And then that's all the missions completed. So there we go. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.